Aaron Boone in the manager's report. Aaron, overall, what did you think of Montgomery? I thought he was good. Um, uh, I, you know, it was really good to see him make some really quality pitches to some good hitters, too, when he was behind in the count. Uh, but he had a little bit of everything going. I actually didn't think he was necessarily quite as sharp as he was, uh, you know, in the exhibition game. But that said, uh, I thought the stuff was good. Uh, again, it's all the mix that we've been seeing, the couple of different fastballs, the ability to cut it, and then the change up in the curveball, which, you know, he didn't use the curveball a lot tonight, but a little bit later on it became a factor for him. But, you know, to – it's been a long time coming for him. Proud of him getting back and, you know, to get us two outs into the six and, and be pretty pitch efficient was exciting. It's been 800 plus days since he got his last win, I believe. Uh, just wow. for him to get back out on the mound and to have some success early on, what do you think that did for him and his confidence? Yeah, you know, look, I, I felt like he came in in a really good place. I mean, he had a great spring training for us picked up where he left off in spring and summer camp and uh, he just continues to be really impressive throwing the ball and I think you're seeing a kid with a lot of confidence right now um, because he knows he has weapons to get good hitters out with. Chad Green then came in struck out four batters in the process. Does his role become even more important in the absence of Tommy Canely? Um Look, every, I mean, I don't know, more important. I mean, Greeny's really important to our team and obviously our success. I mean, so we're going to have to pick up the slack, obviously. You know, Tommy's an elite reliever in the league, so um, some guys are going to have to step up and, and pick up some important outs along the way. And Greeny tonight, to be able to, you know, go through, I, I don't know, six or seven hitters, um, you know, I was a little reluctant to send him out for the third time, but he was so pitch efficient um, that I was. It, it was really good to see him go through the order like he did um, and, and be just so efficient. And Aaron, what is the plan with Kainley? Um So, just have we announced anything yet? No. Just that no. he's. Yep. IL and uh, UCL issue. Yeah, yeah. So he's 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 probably headed for surgery. Um, so you know, you know. I mean, it's just one of those where you know your heart goes out to Tommy right now, and um, you know, knowing that it's a significant injury that's got to get taken care of now. Thanks, Aaron. Mm -hmm. Next question from George King. George, go ahead. Aaron, how different was that Yankee Red Sox experience for you? <laughs> you know, the games for me have been really very normal. Um, from 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 my previous experience, you know, once once the game starts, I'm kind of locked in on all that's going on in the in the game that um, I don't notice T tonight. I certainly notice. I and I think just being back at home and um, you know. <clears throat> Seeing our fans, obviously, in this rivalry, you can't help but to notice uh, usually how intense it is or, or tense even at times. Um, so that, that was missing a little bit. So it was, a, it was definitely a little bit different, but, but at the same time also still pretty easy to lock in on, on what we needed to do. And you're talking about Tommy John surgery with Canley? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Bob Clappers, go ahead. You have the next question. Aaron, there's a number of reports that the season may be, may be in jeopardy. I mean, you guys are off to such a hot start. How concerned are you by, this, by the possibility that it's in danger? Not. Um, you know, we're, we're, we're trying to be the best team we can be right now and trying to do our part and, and you know, hopefully making it continue to happen. But, you know, certain things are obviously out of our control and, um, you know, our job and I'm so proud of our guys for the level of focus and, and competitiveness that they've had day in and day out since we returned for summer camp all the long days then and and now into the season so nothing changes there for us thank you Brian Hope go ahead you have the next question hey Aaron have you noticed anything different with Judge the last three days uh, home runs three straight games um no, not really. I mean, um, you know, first couple games, well, the first game he had a, uh, a good game off of Scherzer and kind of set the tone for us. And then, 
the next couple of games, you know, I, I saw him smoke a couple balls at, at hitter at guys, um, probably miss a couple of pitches where he was in good hitters counts where he just didn't smoke it like he normally would. But, um, no, I mean, he's, he's kind of been pretty steady and consistent, you know, ever since summer camp started up, it's been a lot of quality at bats.